So RIT men's hockey hasn't been back to the NCAA tournament in eight years. Tonight, the Tigers found themselves in the conference championship game against AIC with a simple path to the tournament. Win in advance or lose and your season is over. It was a packed house at the Gene tonight. Plenty of energy, but they were silenced early on. Just four minutes in, long outlet to Jordan Byro, brother of Amherst, Brandon Byro, five hole for one of his two goals on the night, AIC in front. Tigers answer midway through the period. Dimitri Microgianakis tosses it in front off a defender and then we're all tied up. Then five minutes later, Carter Wilkie sends a miss missile on net, bounces out to Elijah Gonzalez. He's not missing from there, folks. RIT takes the lead. AIC would tie it up, so we go to the second. On the power play, point shot stopped. Matthew Wild buries the rebound. Tigers in front, 3-2. And it stayed that way all the way into the final minutes. AIC with the goalie pulled. Gonzalez says he practices these all the time. And as y'all know, practice makes perfect. RIT gets the dub 5-2 and wins the Atlantic Hockey Championship. With more on the win, here's A.J. Feldman. Ever since last season's heartbreaking playoff loss, the RIT men's hockey team was on a mission. Tonight, mission accomplished as the Tigers took down AIC 5-2 in the Atlantic Hockey Championship game, taking this proud program back to the NCAA tournament for the first time in eight years. I think it's just a special thing in our walls. It's always up there. You see the pictures of people who won championships and their team and them hosting the trophy, so it's a constant reminder in the room that that stuff is hard and that's what you really want to accomplish. And uh, to be a part of the group like that, you, you create a memory like that, you're going to see a guy 30 years down the line and you'll remember this for the rest of our lives. We knew we had a good team, so coming in, you know, started in August, we all knew we could go win a championship and we worked at that every day. You know, constant reminders what the goal is and just, you know, really happy we got it done. It took us a little longer to get to our game tonight, but um, I think the players settled themselves down and that's what we needed to do is just settle down here and get to our game. We talk about the standard and the standards winning championships. Like everyone's recruitment pitch, you hear you're going to come to RIT and you're going to win. And that's what got me here. This place is amazing. It's the best five years of my life. A number of former Tigers headed back to Rochester this weekend to experience tonight's championship game and to watch this team head back to the NCAA tournament, including two members from last year's team who flew in from Alaska and British Columbia to be here tonight. As head coach Wayne Wilson said, that's special. That doesn't happen in a lot of programs. Reporting with RIT, I'm AJ Feldman.